Shout out to Steve. We live in Oregon, so we have trees out here. So she's basically saying she hates Mother Nature. So to all you Pacific Northwest nature loving followers of Spicy Mommy, be sure to tell her shadow. She should be grateful for the shadows and the green, healthy air we have out here. Hi mommies, welcome back to my channel. My name is Zania. If you're new here, I want to go ahead and remind you to subscribe. Also hit the little bell so that you get notified every single time I upload some more spicy content. For today's vlog, the winery that we're going to, it's actually funny, I saw another spicy mommy on the gram, posted that she went to this winery, and the reason why I wanted to go was because it's really cute, the setup that they have, like they have little teepees kind of out on the field, individualized for your party, so you get to just be in there with your party, and they're like furnished and everything, just seems like a cute little vibe, so I thought, why not go all the way out? and go to a cute winery for my first time. Also, a little side note, RJ is hungover. Are you okay with me telling the vlog that you made some bad choices last night? We all make bad choices. But the good thing about me is I'm Catholic, so I can go for the best. Reynoso! <laughs> I already tell father, like, father, I made some bad choices drinking last night. And he'll be like, okay, Reynoso, say three help here. Babe! Anyways, <coughs> so ignore the really bad lighting. It's just because, like RJ said, it's Oregon, trees, shadows, and all of the above. But we're on our way to drop Bella off. She's going to be staying with my mom. But yeah, I'm excited. And like I said, I don't even really, you know, drink wine like that. I, don't, I actually don't think I'm excited for the wine. <laughs> if I'm being honest, I'm not necessarily excited for I the think wine. Exci well, I'm excited for the, like, the nature. Like, right? the views and where it's yeah. at, location. Peep the... What's that, a pizza pocket? Mm -hmm. Pizza stick. Pizza stick. Pizza pockets haven't been around since 2014. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> but he's trying to get rid of his hangover. Yeah. And I'm about to shotgun a Coca Cola right now. Yeah. I honestly don't think Coke helps. I think Sprite helps better. No. Sprite's good, but sometimes it just be tasting like syrup afterwards. That's true. But so does Coke. No, it doesn't. All soda. Anyways, you guys will see me in a little bit. I need to put on my lashes still because I don't have any on right now. So I'm still like basic level. Like I'm still like basic bitch right now. But I'm about to be like that bitch. Okay, so we're here now at, it's called Core Cellars, the place, and they started off, started us off with some wine. You can tell mine has the lip gloss right there. V has lipstick, so we'll be able to tell which ones are ours. So they're gonna take us over to our little tent teepee area. It's actually super cute. The drive up here was really nice. I'll explain more as we go because the music. I'm kind of nervous that it's gonna be super, super hot in there because it's already 80. We scheduled this for 11 a.m. So if this wouldn't happen, but it's already hot, so we'll see. And also keep RJ in your thoughts and prayers. You guys know he's having a rough morning. Yeah, decisions were made last night and I'm paying the consequences now. <laughs> decisions were made, not good decisions though. Are you gonna be having me like drink your stuff for you? <laughs> You're gonna feel better with life? Yeah, I think so. We'll see. Probably not. Alright, my friends. It's a beautiful day to have. Yeah. I love the breeze out here. It's great. Seriously. Yeah. Yeah, we should have brought our shape looks. <laughs> We've arrived. <laughs> Which side do you want to sit on? It doesn't matter. I guess over here. Okay. Oh. Oh. So you guys <laughs> yeah, of course it came with the speaker. That's cool. <laughs> Um, but you're really bright. Hey, I'm just gonna leave you up here with the wine. Or <laughs> just like setting up his bed. I'm like low key trying to find the nap position. <laughs> <laughs> like, if you go to a normal winery like Oregon, 
I do have like food, like other ones. Like yeah, this one doesn't, like, huh? This one's so okay, I feel like I'm like so lean back that I'm like <laughs> tripping out. I'm uncomfortable. I feel like my mine's, hair, I mine like, is like in a perfect back. position. <laughs> Tilt that motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> I know. With our nails, like hiding our crusty <laughs> nails. Which one should we start way. with? This is should we just one. go from light to dark? Yeah. yeah, just do them all. Light to dark. Oh shit, you're already done? Yeah. <laughs> See what you guys think about this music. So I kind of want to play this on my channel, on my stream. Yeah. I guess it's just going to be V and I, guys, because... But it's okay because that way we'll have DDs, like you know? Okay. Cheers. Okay, okay that one wasn't bad. Okay, let me educate you guys on what we're drinking. Where is it? It's on the side. Never mind. <laughs> this is all I have, all the info. And I forgot everything the girl said. So, this one's good though. Not bad. I'm not mad at it. The 2020 oh. Aga Savignon. The first one? Sleepy. Oh. This one? Oh, the cheaper one. I'm glad I liked it. We didn't want to get stung, but we don't want to let it drown. What do we do? We need answers now. For real though. Wow, it's swimming better than I can. That sucks. It's all with honey. Here, let me see. I'll pour it back here slowly so it can crawl out. Tell me if it flies away. It's probably yeah. drunk right now. Look, he's alive, guys. Are you gonna join us for number two? Yeah, uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh, he's down to the block. <laughs> That's an immediate no for me. This one's cold. Look. She said bartender. We're gonna finish this one. It's a beautiful day in the hood today. Oh shit, is that a buffalo over there? <laughs> Me like weird. And we already finished our third wine that we're trying, so now we're gonna move on to the dark one, the red one. It's pretty fresh out here because the Columbia is like a mile that way. This is in Lyle, but... Washington, in case yeah. anyone's interested. The place is called Four Cellars. Super nice. Tell them I sent you so they give me a free. Okay. <laughs> me following the camera. <laughs> <laughs> so they give me a free uh, fucking flight next time. Yeah. Just kidding. Good one, bro. Yeah. You guys, we still have two. What are you guys talking about? I huh? know, that's what we said. There's still two more. There's two red ones. We'll get to drinking. <laughs> <laughs> We're testing I'll out new wines for the Game Maybe. of Thrones season six. <laughs> <laughs> this is for Tyrion Lannister right here. Can we gonna get you in camera more? Sorry. This is about me. Look at how crusty my wine glass is for my freaking lip gloss. I'm just gonna chug it. Ooh. I'm sure this is not the way you're supposed to do this. Do not like, try this at home, kids. I feel like it's more tarry. Is that a word? Tarry? <laughs> a tarry? Someone made like a tart? Like, you know tart? tart? Between the little, like, walking. Oh, get the white tea. Video of you. Okay, let's know. I'm taking it easy on the drinking today. I just wanted to be, like, the responsible one today to let you guys know it's okay to be because responsible he sometimes. Because so responsible last night. <laughs> he was slow. <laughs> <laughs> These are barely little baby grapes. Oh, he's sicky. Not like that. I don't feel sick no more. No? This was fun. Thank you for bringing me. You're welcome. Well, I mean, you drove us. Look at that mouth. Look at those tectonic My plates. My edges are spread. I can feel like my mouth. Drinking wine, feeling fine. Drinking more for the team. Drinking my bros. <laughs> Definitely need some food, guys. Comida. We ate nothing for breakfast. Your comadre is a bully and says, You gotta fucking at least drink the starting wine. <laughs> this is not sponsored by Dare. V <laughs> brings out her little Dare t shirt for her first. <laughs> Argy's acting like he doesn't get paid to be the person that holds my camera. We drank all the wine. I just have a little bit of RJ's. I'm taking one for the team. What do you guys feel? Would you guys come back? Honestly, I actually yeah. really like the vibe here. The else was here, except for like a few people, but they're like 
he passed away. The hosts away. were pretty nice, And too. the hosts were really nice. And this is be sane. Honestly, the drive was kind of, it was like a two-hour drive, but it is kind of worth it because we kind of came and we're on our own. The hosts were super nice. We didn't bump into anybody from our hometown, so that's always a bonus. You pay extra for that. Okay. <laughs> so before we have a repeat of what RJ lived last night, we should move on to the next activity. Let's get some food. They asked us to bring all of the freaking uh, stuff back. Basically, we're hired. We're part-time. We're, we're on payroll now. Water cup empty too, because we got to hydrate up. It is hot. Okay, mommy, so we made it back home. I miss my bebe. She was a little bit mad at us when we picked her up for my mom's. I mean, she loves going to my mom's. She's just so sassy, and I've told you guys about this before. I don't record her as much because I don't want to be, like, in her face with the camera, but I'm going to try to see if I can start capturing some more of these moments because I swear, she's just so sassy. We're in the car. She's in the back right, and I could see her through my mirror, and we're talking to her, and we're like, oh, my gosh, we miss her so much. And she's like this. Like, I can't make this up. She's, like, hilarious. But also, like, I don't want her to think it's funny because I'm not trying to make her be rude or anything. <laughs> She's also, look, can you guys see that the handle's turning? She's starting to learn how to use the, or how to open the doors, and it worries me a little bit. But anyways, we had so much fun today. I feel like a couple of things that we learned from this trip. If we're gonna go on a faraway little road trip for an adventure, then we definitely need to make sure that we have breakfast before. We didn't do that. And then we drank wine, and we were fine. Like, nobody got drunk or anything. We just did a, a little tasting. We didn't do anything crazy because we're not that experienced with wine or anything like that. And then we went and we grabbed some food, and so everybody after that, because like the weather is just warm and we had the windows down and it just put everybody in a super relaxed mood so I just feel like we all were ready for a nap so right now Bella's ready for a nap we're gonna see if we can actually try to take a family nap prior to getting pregnant naps were like not something that I ever really was into but now that I'm a mom whenever I get a chance especially when we take family naps and the three of us fall asleep that's the best especially if Bella sleeps for like over an hour and a half and we're like yes it feels so good I'm not really sure what we're gonna do later we're probably just gonna take her out for a walk and then we'll figure out what we're gonna do for dinner but other than that the vibes are just to relax you know zen vibes get ready for the week mentally i just been kind of feeling very overwhelmed and it's been really hard for me to like manage everything that's on my to-do list so i did start recently doing some things on my phone and if this works out with how i'm organizing myself then i'll let you guys know and share some of the tips and tricks that i learned with that this was something that rj kind of put me on because he saw that i was kind of struggling he's like you need to write stuff down and like you know kind of helping me out he showed me a video with like a how-to tutorial and so i was like yes king we're here for that please help me take care of my mental health um and so we'll see how that goes don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up also stay tuned i will be bringing you guys along for more adventures um we'll see what the rest of this month and also just the rest of the summer Ugh, lip gloss we'll see what the rest of the summer brings our way so i'll definitely be trying to vlog a lot more and just sharing those experiences with you guys also another side note i'm full of side notes i'm actually gonna miss this view like i'm really excited for our house the view that we have here in our apartment is really not that bad other than like our neighbors right down here or any of them outside <laughs> uh because they actually kind of have like a messy yard but everyone else and we just have like a really wide view so i'll show you guys real quick It's not that bad, right? Like, it's kind of nice. Okay, lastly, I will be leaving you guys with a positive affirmation. And the positive affirmation for this video is that you do deserve to make the best out of this summer after the year and a half that we've had with COVID, all of the things that have been going on, and us starting to get a little bit of normal back. This is just like the perfect reason or perfect excuse, the perfect reminder. We only live once. We need to make the best out of the time that we have. I feel like our mental health for a lot of people has gone through a lot during this time. As long as you're being safe and you're being respectful of others and those around you, go ahead and go out and have fun. With that being said, that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and see you guys on the next one. Peace.